Okay, um, good day, everyone. Welcome to another session of um, how to use Halo Network better. So, in this video, we'll be basically going through um, a general overview of Halo Network. We'll also be um, I would also be refreshing your memory on how to add Halo Network to Metamax. I'd also um, tell you how to add BSEHO to Metamax and PancakeSwap. Okay, I'd also show you how to buy HO tokens from PancakeSwap, BSEHO, that is HO tokens in Binance Smart Chain from PancakeSwap. And I'll also show you how to buy HO tokens from Hotcoin Global. And um, we're also going to talk about the Nebo DAO launch. And just a general overview of the product of Halo Network, such as Halo Bridge, POS Nodes, Hostswap, and the likes of them. So, first of all, let's look at how you can add Halo Network or Halo Minute to your Metamax. As you can see, my Metamax is currently in Halo Minute. So if you're just opening Metamax account for the first time, or you already have a Metamax account, but you don't have Halo Minute added, you can simply just click on this place, you click on Add Network. Then you would put the network name, the ROPC URL of Halo Network. You would find those details in an article I'll place in the description section of this video. So this is the article. The network name is Hello Minnet. You use either of each node. We have node 1, node 2, node 3. The chain ID is 1 to 80. The symbol is HO as you can see here. So after adding um, Metamax, uh, Hello Network to your Metamax, then the next is um, Adding in for, for in, in case you've not added Binance Smart Chain to your MetaMask, as you can see, BSC Minutes. In case you've not added it yet, you can also add it the necessary article to help you do that will be in the description section of this video. Okay, um, so far the price of um, HU has been on a very good pump. It has been on a very good pump. I would put the link to the Telegram channel in the description section of this video. There is a bot in the um, Telegram channel that helps you check the price of HU tokens. It has really, really been doing well. So recently, there was an announcement there. Um, Halo Network partnered with NebuDAO. NebuDAO is a Halo GameFi based D app. It's a DAO found by gaming enthusiasts of the Halo ecosystem. It is a vital platform for integrating users to the Halo metaverse. Users can explore the metaverse in a DAO assisted manner as pioneers in the Nebu DAO ecosystem. And doing so, they can also earn ecological rights and rewards. I'm also going to put the link to the Medium article on the Nebu DAO launch in the description section of this video. So let's quickly go to how you can buy um, HO tokens. We're going to be starting with pancakes. Well, let's start with pancakes. Well. Okay, to do this, as you can see, whenever you want to use pancake swap, your it has to be in Binance Smart Chain. So I would connect wallets. Connect wallets. So after you've connected wallets, for you to buy HU tokens from PancakeSwap, you fundamentally need um, BNB or 
um, USDT. I would advise you have BNB because even if you have USDT, you would need BNB to pay gas fees or transaction fees. So, go to exchange. So I have just about five dollar worth of BNB. So if I want to buy BSCHO, I'd search. I don't think I've added it on this PC, so I'd have to add it manually. Okay, I've not added it on this PC. So you just simply use the um article how to buy. I'm going to post this article in the description section of this video. So. What we want to take from this article is the contract address of BSCHO. So when you get the contract address, you can just simply add it to your pancake swap. Now. So yes, it's you copy it. And then you go to your pancake swap. And then you paste it. It's going to pop up just like it has. So you click on import, you click on I understand, and then you click on import again. So having done that, I have some BSCH, though they are in decimals. Having done that, you can simply buy HO tokens. From, this is how you buy HO tokens. So if I have BNB, I don't have much BNB. If I have BNB, I would simply have bought BSCH. insufficient balance so that's basically how you do it you have you need to have either bnb or usdt and then you extract the contract address and then you paste it and then you simply swap one other thing you can do with the pancake swap is creating a liquidity pool now we can create a liquidity pool. As you can see, I already have a liquidity pool. I have created a liquidity pool of BSCHO and USDT. Um, I'm already farming this pool. I'll talk about farming when I come to the products of Halo Network under the host swap. So I am already farming this liquidity pool. So when you create this liquidity pool, because you created it from Pancake Swap, it will be in Binance Smart Chain. So you're going to use one of the um, most exciting feature of Halo Network, which is the Halo Bridge, to convert it from Binance Smart Chain to Halo Minutes. Having done that, then you can be able to farm your liquidity pool tokens. So that's how to buy HO tokens from Halo from PancakeSwap. So let's simply go. Let's quickly go to Hotcoin Global. If you're joining Hotcoin Global for the first time, you would be required to create an account and whenever you want to log in you would be asked to check your email for verification so after you've successfully created an account you can come to, and you want to buy HO tokens you can come to you click on at the top right corner you click on exchange account it's going to bring out this interface so as you can see, uh, I have bought about three HO tokens, which is equivalent to $7.944. So if you want to buy HO tokens from Hotcoin Global, you click on the de deposits. Um, if you're joining for the first time, you can just simply search HO. When you search HO, it's going to take you to, it's going to give you these options and you click on this first one. When you click on deposits, make sure what you see is hello network then you can simply copy this address you copy this address and then you go to your metamax under ho you change the chain from binance to hold a minute so you simply go here and then you click on send i think i have sent some you click on send and then you put in the address you just copied. Let me do that. So you simply put in the address you just copied. As you can see here, then you choose how much HO you want to have in your Hotcoin Global account. 
So that is basically how to buy um, HR tokens from Hotcoin Global. Okay. Um, having done that, let's talk about the products of Halo Network. So we're basically going to be looking at just um, a few products of Halo Network. I'm going to start with the Halo Bridge. So this is what the um, interface of Halo Network looks like, whom ecosystem governance tools, developer, and all of that. So all the products of Halo Network, you're going to find it on the ecosystem. So the Halo Bridge is um, the product of Halo Network that helps you move tokens from Binance Smart Chain to Halo Mainnet. I am specifically calling only Binance Smart Chain because for now, the Halo Bridge only supports swap or cross-chain swap from Binance Smart Chain to Halo Network and um, Halo Network to Binance Smart Chain. But as you can see here, uh, with time, it's going to take, it's going to support other chains such as Polkadot, Ethereum, Tron, and the likes of them. So, so this is how this is what the Halo Bridge looks like. Okay, this is what the Halo Bridge looks like. I have some USDT that are um, in Halo Minnet. Oh, I think I have already cross chain swapped it. I would have to confirm that. Okay, when you're using the Halo Bridge function of Halo Network, make whenever you're using any function of or product of Halo Network, make sure that your chain is in. Hello network. It's currently in Binance Smart Chain, so you're not going to be seeing the wallet balances. So we'll go back to MetaMax and switch it to Hello Minnet. Then my balance would show. As you can see, I have fifty-four dollars worth of USDT in Hello Minnet. Yeah, the balance is supposed to show now. Yeah, the balance has shown. So I could simply convert this USDT from Halo Minnet to Binance Smart Chain, and then you can withdraw it. Anyhow, you you can also um, convert it to Binance Smart Chain, use it to buy BSEHO, and you can also convert the USDT to HO using the whole swap feature. So that brings us to the second fun um, feature of Halo Network, which is the whole swap. Under the host swap, just like the pancake swap, but host swap is for the Halo network. You can you have um, exchange and also the creation of liquidity pool. So in the exchange, you can simply use it to exchange tokens for one another. Tokens that are in the Halo minutes. I didn't know tokens that are in the Halo minutes. So you just simply see it here. We have the HOS, which is the governance token of Halo Network. We have HO, we have USDT, Halo Peg USDT, and WHO. So if I have HO tokens, I can simply um, swap it to USDT in Halo Minute. And if I have USDT, I can do the same. So you can also create liquidity pools. As you can see, you can also create liquidity pools. Why is my I have to connect wallets. You can also create liquidity pool using the whole swap feature. Uh, as you can see, the first one is HOUSDT. The next one is HOSHO and BSEHOUSDT. Now, this BSEHOUSDT, um, you would have to create the liquidity pool from pancake swap and then use the halo bridge function to um, change the chain from binance smart chain to halo network as you can see you ha i already have this farming status here it means i'm farming about 10.718 liquidity pool tokens um, the apro is 145 percent that's the annual percentage rate so far, I have earned 
HOS, which is the governance token. So that's quickly, this is simply the um, host swap feature. It helps you um, convert tokens and you can also farm liquidity pool tokens. If you want to add to this liquidity pool, you click on this plus sign. And if you want to withdraw, you can just simply withdraw. So let's go back to the last feature of Halo Network I'm going to be talking about is the POS nodes. The POS nodes. Okay, the POS nodes is um, a way whereby users tend to pledge their HO tokens so that they can obtain voting rights of governance proposals and super nodes. So before V2, um, the current POS node now is V2. Before V2, you can simply pledge any amount of HO tokens, but currently you can only pledge 100 HO tokens. So if you were um, farming, sorry, if you had already pledged in V1, for you to pledge in V2, you would have to redeem your profits first and redeem your whatever you pledged first before you can re-pledge. But to re-pledge, you need 100 HO tokens. So pledging by pledging in the POS nodes, you see you get voting rights to of governance proposals, you get to make decisions and all of that. No, so I would always, in all my videos, I also always want to talk about the Halo community. If you belong to an Halo community, if you belong to any community, you will get 100% returns of your pledged HO tokens in the POS node. But if you don't belong to any community, you would only get 90%. So that brings us to how can you be part of a community? To be part of a community, if you're just joining for the first time, you... Click on Halo Community. Because I, I have already activated myself, I belong to a community, you, I can activate someone. But if you're joining for the first time, you would see a button here that would tell you to enable. To enable that, you need little HO tokens just for the fees. Then you can copy that hash and send to anybody that is, on, that is already activated that has this activated user status to activate you. So that is basically all for on the products of Halo Network. Do well to subscribe to my YouTube channel so that you can get more updates on how to use Halo Network better and get the best from Halo Network. Thank you so much and have a nice day.